Hello everyone, today I will be discussing the one of a necessary for a common applications of electricity and that is what we call Ohm's law. So what is Ohm's law? Ohm's law is useful in calculating V, I, and R in a closed circuit. In a closed circuit. Closed circuit because if the circuit is open, then uh, no current in the entire circuit. So V is full voltage for voltage. I is per current. And R is for resistance. Now what is voltage? Example in this circuit. We have the battery as a voltage source and the resistor. Now this battery has an excess of protons. And excess of electrons that can be produced through some chemical reactions under conversions of chemical energy. Now, these electrons and protons forces the charge to move. It forces this uh, battery. I mean, it this battery forces the charges to move. It forces. And when when the charge moves. It is what we call current. So current is is a, a charge in motion. Now, what is now we have here the resistor. Now, what is resistor and the purpose of it? Resistor has a resistance that opposes the current. So resistance is the opposition to current. Now. If this resistor has a low resistance, low resistance, then it opposes more current. Now, if this resistor has a is has a uh, high resistance, then it opposes low current. So that is what we call resistance. So let us proceed to the Next one, the three versions of Ohm's law. So what are the three versions of Ohm's law? Now the three versions is one is the uh, the current I is equals to B over R. That is the first version. The next is the voltage V is equals to I times R. And uh, the last, the resistance R is equals to V over I. So here in the first version, this tells that if V is, I mean, if R is constant, meaning it doesn't change, R is constant, then I and V are directly proportional. Directly proportional. Meaning that if there's an increase with the voltage, the current also increase. Now, if the uh, now if the uh, voltage decrease, the current also decrease. With with the uh, with the resistance constant. Now, here in the second versions, it tells only the potential difference, potential difference between two points.
between two points. That is the uh, second version that's about. Now here, in the last version, the third and final version of Ohm's law, the resistance R is equals to V over I. That's about that. If uh, should be, oh, yeah, yeah. That's about that. If this B is constant, then I and R are directly proportional. R, I mean, sorry, inversely proportional. I and R are inversely proportional. I and R. Meaning that if R goes down, then I goes up. If R goes up, then I goes down. So that's it. That is the uh, the uh, the what we call Ohm's law, and the three versions of Ohm's law.